Hi, my name is Paulina Lopez. I am a business coach, a business strategist, and the CEO and founder of The Business of We. We is for women entrepreneurs. And what it is, it's an initiative specifically for women that are looking to either revamp, expand, or even grow their own initiatives. I'm so blessed and grateful that it was a natural transition from my past life in corporate, which was in finance and human resources. In finances, it was more about streamlining operations, so it was very linear and technical, and it really showed me how to expand on a business, to grow, launch a business, and the everyday process of what it is to run a business. But in human resources, I would say that's where I got the greatest value, working with people. And I witnessed firsthand true potential being denied opportunity just based on how they looked on paper. So that actually excited me to identify leaders and identify that passion that's within each and every one of us to do something greater. So one of my lowest points and what I would say my turning point was actually when I was a single mom and I was in corporate and I decided to go back to school and in that process I thought I was doing something for my daughter. She was a young lady at the time and I wanted to be an example for her. Instead that became one of the hardest things because I had a very tough custody battle with my ex-husband and it immediately changed my entire life because I had to not go back to school like I wanted and I had to seek other jobs just to, to approach and pursue all the greater things I wanted to do, uh, obviously with a different path. So that custody battle was actually quite a learning experience for me, but it was also where I got to meet some really phenomenal, amazing people that pushed me, inspired me, motivated me to keep on going, and that something great was there. That's when my entrepreneurial spirit kicked in and it was a fire, it was a passion. And with that, I started to seek more uh, personal development, more than professional. And I did attended workshops, I attended retreats, I got a mentor, I invested in a coach, which I had never heard of that before. And if my younger self was sitting next to me right now, the most powerful advice that I would give her is, number one, have the confidence to do anything you want. Feel the fear and do it anyway. And most importantly, invest in yourself, your growth, your personal development, and your professional development.